Hello, how to solve for x and y from this given nice math Olympiad problem? x square minus y is equal to 111, y square minus x is equal to 111, provided x is not equal to y. Solution. x square minus y is equal to 111. Let's call this equation 1. y square minus s is equal to 1, 1, 1. Let's call this equation 2. Then we can subtract equation 1 from equation 2. That is, s square minus y minus y square minus s is equal to 1, 1, 1 minus 1, 1, 1. s square minus y minus y square plus s is equal to zero now we can compare this we have a square a and y square here this is a square minus y square plus x minus y is equal to zero a square minus y square is in form of perfect square which can be written as s plus y multiplied by s minus y plus s minus y is equal to zero then if you look at this s minus y is common let's bring it out s minus y bracket if you divide this by this we have s plus y and if you divide this by this we have one is equal to zero there are two cases here the first case and the second case the first case is s minus y is equal to zero therefore s is equal to y and the second case is s plus y plus 1 is equal to 0. But from here, the question says x is not equal to y. Therefore, s is equal to y is undefined. Since s is not equal to y, then we consider this s plus y if you take this one to the other side you become minus one let's call this equation three now let's add equation one and two together add equation one and two s square minus y plus y square minus s is equal to one 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 plus one 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 s square plus y square minus x minus y is equal to two 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 then s square plus y square will be equal to two 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 plus s plus y but we know that x plus y is equal to minus 1. Then x square plus y square is equal to 2, 2, 2 plus minus 1. x square plus y square is equal to 2, 2, 1. Let's call this equation 4. From equation 3, That is, s plus y is equal to minus 1. Let's square both sides. s plus y square is equal to minus 1 square. This is equal to 1. Then we know that from this exponential rule that, we know from this rule that s plus y square, this is equal to, s square plus 2 s 
y plus y squared. So, which is equal to 1. And therefore, we have x squared plus 2xy plus y squared is equal to 1. Then, x squared plus y squared plus 2xy is equal to 1. But, x squared plus y squared is equal to 2, 2, 1 from equation 4. Then we have 2, 2, 1 plus 2xy is equal to 1. 2xy is equal to 1 minus 2, 2, 1. Then 2xy is equal to minus 2, 2, 0. Let's divide both sides by 2. Divided by 2. This we cancel this. 2 here, 1. 2 here, 1, 1, 1. 1, 1, 0. 1, 1, 0. Then, SY is equal to minus 1, 1, 0. So, let's make Y the subject of the formula. Divided by x, divided by s, then this we cancel this, y is equal to minus 110 over x. Let's call this equation 5. From equation 3, s plus y is equal to minus 1, then we know that y is equal to minus 1, 1, 1 over x. This is s plus minus 1, 1, 0 over s is equal to minus 1. Then, if you cross multiply, s square minus 1, 1, 0 is equal to minus x. s square plus s minus 1, 1, 0 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula or factorization method. But in this case, let's make use of factorization method. Factorization method, the product must be equal to minus 1, 1, 0. This is equal to minus 10 multiplied by 11. This is equal to minus 1, 1, 0. And the sum is equal to minus 10 plus 11. This is equal to 1. Now, let's substitute here. We have s square minus 10 s plus 11 s minus 110 is equal to 0. Then s bracket s minus 10 plus 11 bracket s minus 10 is equal to 0. Now s minus 10 is common here. We have s minus 10 bracket s plus 11 is equal to 0. Then there are two cases here. The first case is s minus 10 is equal to 0. Therefore, s is equal to 10. And from the second case, s plus 11 is equal to 0. Therefore, S is equal to minus 11. Since we've gotten the value of S, which is equal to 10, let's call this X1, and S is equal to minus 11. Then we can solve for Y. But Y is equal to minus 110 over X. When X S1 is equal to what? 10. Then y will be equal to minus 110 over 10. This will cancel this. y is equal to minus 11. Let's call this y1. Also, when 
S2 is equal to minus 11. Y will be equal to minus 110 over X. Y is equal to minus 110 over minus 11. Y is equal to 10. Let's call this Y2. Therefore, our final answers are S, Y is equal to 10, minus 11 or S, Y is equal to minus 11, 10. This is the final answer if you enjoyed the video please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe thank you bye bye